Let's now focus on the information this model contains, or the I in BIM. Salibri Model Checker includes a very powerful function for mining the BIM models for information. Takeoff, or ITO, can extract almost any information available in the model in real time without any programming. Let's look at the space usage in the building. Information can be classified in the BIM tool and also in Salibri Model Checker. We can see circulation spaces, office spaces, and so on. This classification will be utilized further as we make spatial reports. Let's make a space report using a predefined information ITO template. With this template, we can collect information on the spaces, such as their usage, area, and volume measurement. This table can be further used by exporting the information into a spreadsheet. ITO is a very efficient and visual way of taking off almost any information from the model. What you see is what you get in real time. With the extracted information, it is possible to drill further into the data. Here, for example, we are able to select and report, for example, certain types of spaces. By simply selecting the first floor spaces, we are able to visualize the first floor space usage. Let's open a predefined structural quantity ITO definition. Here, for example, basement walls are visualized, so if there are differences in the wall types, this can be spotted instantly. Or we can visualize certain types of spaces only. Let's make an ad hoc query. It takes just a few steps to select the columns for the information we need to have collected from the model. All the information available in the model can be reported this way. Please note that you can add what rule sets should be checked to assure good quality and reliable reports. Use rules first, and then with ITO you can see what you get in your takeoffs. Now we can see what ITO can do to help in managing BIM information. Having ITO combined with quality assurance, Salibri Model Checker concentrates on the I in BIM, making the design process and construction phase more cost-effective and productive. MEP Quality Assurance with Salibri Model Checker Let us now look briefly at how MEP models can be analyzed with Salibri Model Checker. We will use a hospital project as an example. First, we will see how an MEP model can be analyzed together with the architectural model. Then we will briefly look at how an MEP model can be checked for internal quality. We are looking for interferences of two models, building services and architectural models. Salibri Model Checker has automatically checked the models and assigned severity categories to all design issues found. Let's select Wall Interferences. You can see quite a large number of interferences, but we can filter out low and moderate problems and zero in on the most critical problems in order to help the designer focus on the most important design issues. Here, for example, the ducts are going through a wall in a way that definitely needs to be fixed. This is an issue that would be a real problem during construction. Let's look at the intersections within the building services model itself. Now we will select the ventilation system model for closer inspection. Let's hide low and medium severity issues first. For example, here we have an intersection, which is quite complicated. Let's take a closer look. This situation is obviously a problem. Let's add the rest of the related duct components so we can see the whole situation even better. Taking into account the space above the suspended ceiling is very limited. This type of problem would be difficult to fix during the construction phase. Now you've seen how Salibri Model Checker is able to easily locate design issues, making the design quality better, and saving costs during the construction. Structural Quality Assurance with Salibri Model Checker Let us now look briefly at how structural models can be analyzed with Salibri Model Checker. First, we will see how a Tecla model can be analyzed. Then, 
we will briefly look at how an ARCHICAD and a TECLA model compatibility can be checked. Let's take the ARCHICAD demonstration project and include the structural model from TECLA. Please note that the system can recognize architectural and structural models. When you have more models, it's practical to also add identifiers to the models like here. We use STR. In this case, the structural model is actually very simple from the checking point of view. Let's go to the Model Checking tab. On the Checking Layout, let's select two rule sets for model checking, General BIM Validation for analyzing the structural design, and Structural versus Architectural for analyzing the two models and their compatibility. Let's run the automated model analysis. Please note that design issues located are automatically assigned a severity category. Let's see what sort of design issues we have in the structural model. Celebri has, for example, located beam intersections of HEA600 and IPE200 type beams. Let's look at them in detail. Celebri visualizes all issues found for easy analysis and decision making. On the BIM quality side, we have some internal structural interferences with the beams. The way these beams are interfering looks like some connections details are still missing. Let's compare structural and architectural models. Here we can see that there is a mismatch between the structural and architectural components. Here is another example where you can see differences with the red structural elements compared with the blue elements of the architectural model. Celebri Model Checker visualizes different models with different colors, in this case the architectural model with the color red. Now you have seen how Celebri Model Checker is able to easily locate design issues, making the design process more productive, and pinpoint issues that would require rework during the construction phase, minimizing quality costs. Improving the design in ARCHICAD once all the desired analysis have been completed in Celebri Model Checker, designers can again open the analyzed BIM model and do all the necessary design improvements. ARCHICAD also provides advanced tools to manage changes of the IFC models. We will now activate the file, File Special, IFC 2x3, Detect IFC Model Changes menu command. The IFC Change Detection Wizard will guide us through the necessary steps. First, we have to specify the old version of the structural model. Then, we must specify the new version of the structural model. We can define the elements we wish to compare in the Change Detection process. For now, we will compare all element types. As you can see, ARCHICAD already displays the number of the new, modified, and deleted elements prior to merging the IFC model changes only to the current architectural project. Here we can also specify the layers we wish to use to merge the compared version elements. Finally, we click the Merge button to proceed. In just a few seconds, ARCHICAD will merge only the detected changes of the received IFC model versions and display the markup tool palette. This palette already lists all the model changes with color codes. Let's select the first entry in the markup list. This is a new element and is identified in blue. We can zoom into this element. As you can see, this is the horizontal steel beam created by the structural engineer earlier. Let's select the second deleted element indicated in red. Let's delete this markup entry. ARCHICAD will offer to delete the corresponding elements with the markup entry. Let's select and delete the next markup entry, representing the deleted middle steel beam. Let's select the next modified building elements represented in green. Zoom in and select these modified elements. 
when we hover the mouse over the selected columns, ARCHICAD will display the layer of the selected element in the Info tag. The column placed on the IFC Imported Old layer represents the previous position of the column. The column placed on the IFC Imported New displays the new position of the column. Based on this information, we can decide about the next design steps. With the help of Celebri Model Checker, designers can discover construction errors and interferences of architectural and structural elements, which would be hard to spot and identify using standard processes. We can also ensure more integrated and streamlined project delivery and provide benefits for all designers, engineers and consultants, as well as the client. Let's briefly overview some actual projects where architects and engineers implemented this IFC-based OpenBIM collaboration design workflow in their architecture practice. The Panorama Tower Office Center has been designed by Larkas and Lane Architects and realized in Espoo, a city close to Helsinki, Finland. The office center consists of three building masses that are connected to each other. The total floor area is over 22,000 square meters. That is over 235,000 square feet. The architectural design model was created using Graphisoft ARCHICAD. This project model presents all the architectural elements and aspects of the tower. The structural model was created in Tecla Structures. Both are true BIM models, including a very high level of detail about the information they present. Celebri Model Checker was used to validate the designs and check for interferences and to detect collisions. Here you can see the combined architectural and structural building information as one single model file. All the problems have been solved in the combined model. It's important to emphasize that even though both architectural and structural models contain a high level of detail, the file size of the model remains small and therefore very manageable as one single project file. Let's take a very quick look at some other projects as well. All these projects have been designed by other architectural and engineering teams, but they all share some common aspects. All were developed using Graphisoft ARCHICAD and Celebri Model Checker. The architectural and engineering teams implemented the previously described IFC-based OpenBIM collaboration workflow. Via Rumaki Congress Center is located next to Finland's largest sports academy. The center hosts over 400,000 people each year. Poiri provided the design development as Poiri Integrated Design and Delivery Service from the early sketches to full BIM model. The total time from planning to the finished building on site took less than 18 months. The in-house merged model served as essential aid for multidiscipline design coordination. We hope that you found this presentation useful and will share the opinion of architects and engineers. Open BIM collaboration is the future of the AEC industry. Thank you for taking the time to watch this presentation.